No score through the first, but in the second, Sully Bailey tosses over the middle to Paul Cooner, and he takes off. He sprints away, but is brought down at the 41. Dons push it further downfield. Then Sully Bailey hands off to Ellis Berger, and he breaks through the line, heads down the sideline, and fights his way into the end zone. Akalani strikes first. Then a few minutes later, Sully Bailey turns and takes a beat before spinning back and firing to Paul Cooner. Cooner hustles his way down 10 yards before being pushed out of bounds. Then, hey, it worked last time. Why not go again? Sully Bailey flips to Ellis Berger, and he flies into the end zone to put the Dons up by 14. Akalanes will score once more to take a 21-point lead into halftime. Then O'Dowd coming out firing. Owen Merritt unloads downfield to Makari Keenan, and he stays just in bounds for a huge pickup. Akalanes, though, again, holds the and the score stands until the fourth. Then Jake Boselli tosses back to Paul Cooner, and Cooner keeps racking up the yards. This one, a 30-yard run to bring the Dons in striking distance, and Jake Boselli punches it in here to extend the lead to 28. The Dragons, though, keep fighting, and with a minute and a half left in the game, Owen Merritt goes one way, switches it up, scrambles, and maneuvers his way into score to get O'Dowd on the board, and that will be it. 28-7 is your final.